next grammar point is the emphatic reflexive pronouns. When an action in a sentence is reflected back to the subject, it is expressed by an emphatic reflexive pronoun. In English, you can add the suffix self to the pronoun to convey the emphasis back to the subject. For example, in English, in the sentences, I wrote this letter myself or the teacher himself told me, the word myself and himself are emphatic reflexive pronouns. In Hindi, the emphatic reflexive pronoun is apne aap. The Urdu version khud is also used very frequently. In formal written text, the Sanskritized version swam is also used, but it is rarely used in conversation. All three forms, apne aap, khud and swam are synonyms and can be used interchangeably. Let's take some example sentences. Ye kaam maine apne aap kiya. I did this job myself. Wo khud mere paas aai. She came to me herself. Humne ye ghar apne aap banaya hai. We have built this house ourselves. Apna kaam apne aap karna chahiye. Everybody should do their jobs themselves. Kya tum swam ye patr likhoge? Will you write the letter yourself? The use of swam is very common on the titles of the self-study Hindi textbooks. Swam Hindi sikhe. Teach yourself Hindi. The literal translation is learn yourself Hindi. So, to translate the emphatic pronoun from Hindi into English, just add the suffix self to the pronoun. With a simple postposition, the reflexive pronoun apne aap can be reduced to apne. Both the short and the long versions are correct. Ask yourself, apne aap se pucho, apne se pucho. The verb ask, puchna, takes the postposition se. So, apne aap se pucho or apne se pucho. Ask yourself. Wo apne aap ko nahi chahata. Wo apne ko nahi chahata. He doesn't like himself. Aap apne aap par gussa kyon ho rahe hain? Aap apne par gussa kyon ho rahe hain? Why are you angry at yourself? With the compound postpositions such as ke liye, meaning for, ke saath, meaning with, the reflexive pronoun is always apne, never apne aap. Maine ye patrika apne liye kharidi. I bought this magazine for myself. Pitaji mujko apne saath nahi le jate. Father does not take me with him. Sirf apne baare mein mat tocho. Do not think only about yourself. Apne liye padho, mere liye nahi. Study for yourself, not for me.